All right, welcome back to another video from the Clark and Addison Gaming Company. My name is Brian Hafferkamp. I'm the designer and creator at uh, Clark and Addison Gaming Company. And today I'm going to be showing you a new football game. Uh, just kind of put it together and uh, seeing where it's going to go. As I'm looking around, doing a little bit of research on football, I'm a little amazed in some ways that uh, classic sort of dice mechanics for sports games aren't really a part of a lot of football games excuse me and they were uh if you go back to the 50s 60s 40s you know back when these games were sort of beginning uh you do get some of those games and you get some just sort of straight ahead rollers uh but these days most of the games are either drive by drive um which those are quicker playing games but once you once you get into full play football games it gets you know, into the 10 or 20 foot section pretty quickly. You know, the drop off is, is not gradual. Uh, there aren't a lot of games kind of in the middle where you can play every play, but then, um, the mechanics are kind of easy and, and it's got a lot of, uh, flexibility as far as what teams you could play and all that kind of stuff. So, uh, I thought, well, you know, I've made a lot of dice baseball games, uh, just from sort of old school mechanics, classic dice baseball. And uh, I thought, well, I have on base. Why can't I make a football game that's similar to on base? So that's what I did. I made a football game <laughs> sort of similar to on base baseball uh, where you roll for an outcome. And basically, you're going to get everything that you need uh, from one roll. And then there may be a modification or something like that if you need to check for a touchdown on a, a punt return or something like that or have to do a penalty roll or you know, there aren't a lot of second rolls necessarily. Most of the plays are going to come off of the first roll, including a player finder, um, a quick little player finder for uh, this game that we're going to, to test here. I played one game. It came down to the very last drive, um, the very last play. They scored a touchdown. They were down 27-21, and the home team scored and kicked the field goal and won the game on the last play. So it was pretty exciting, actually. They were down by... Uh, they were down like 27-10 and then came back uh, to win. No, it wasn't 27-10. Was it 27-7 20, maybe? Something like that. 27-14. Uh, and then they came back with a couple touchdowns in the third quarter. I mean the fourth quarter and they won the ball game. So I can see definitely some potential for excitement here. And uh, we'll see how this thing goes. Over here is our main uh, sheet. So this would be, you know, if you're familiar with on-base baseball, this would be like your sort of uh, player columns kind of thing. And so we have our rushing and our passing plays here. We have our penalties, which are denoted here by the uh, yellow and blue. And so we have penalties here. We have our punting and punt returns, field goals and extra points, kickoffs and kickoff returns. So that's uh, going to get us mostly where we need to go in this one. And this game is going to be between the 2023 Chiefs and the Vikings. So the Chiefs at the Vikings. I put together this little sort of basic player finder. Uh, you can see here this is their actual distribution of uh, passing plays to running plays. So on the initial roll, we're going to roll 2d6 uh, dice, which is going to get us our play. We're going to roll two D10s, which is going to get us our play type. And then if we need to check, uh, let's say we want to know it's a twins wide receiver. Twins is the play. Uh, it's a pass to the wide receiver complete for 15 yards. And then you could roll or look here on the red die and you can see which receiver that went to. So if you wanted to keep some uh, simple stats, you could do that as well. Um, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to keep this sort of out of the way just as a reference. And I think after, you know, a couple of, uh, a couple of possessions, I'll probably understand their passing and running numbers. Excuse me. I have our no huddle football, uh, game field and play clock. We have our downs here and yeah, I'm using Minnesota and Kansas city numbers here for these, uh, for the back and forth on the field. Minnesota will always be going this way. Kansas City will always be going that way. So you can always kind of keep track of, of where things are. I like to do it that way. 
and we need to uh, roll for the coin toss. So take our d6 and roll for the coin toss. Uh, I always do one to three for the visiting team, four to six for the uh, home team. So that's going to be Minnesota with the opportunity to receive or defer. They'll defer to the second half. And so it's going to be in the first quarter, KC getting the ball first. <clears throat> and so this plays really uh, pretty easily. On kickoffs, you only need the two D6s unless you need a D10 at some point. But we read it low number first, just like on, on base baseball. So not 11 to 66, like uh, 36 chances, but only 21 chances. So a little fewer numbers. Um, maybe it would be better to do 36. I have no idea. Uh, I don't really know the math as well on the 36, but I think it's just it's the same percentages. It's just more opportunities. So that would be more of your uh, APA style. <clears throat> Excuse me. That'd be more of your APA style game. 11 to 66 with 36 chances. Hopefully my voice won't crap out here. And so Minnesota is going to be kicking off. A 16 is how we read that. So 1-6. And on a kickoff, a 60-yard kickoff, uh, that means that the ball will go down to the 5 because it starts at the 35, so 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. <clears throat> and now we got to roll for the return. A 46 is here. Fourth from the bottom, so one, two, three, four. And that's going to be good for a 30 yard return, actually. 10, 20, 30. So out to the 35 is where the Chiefs will start. And it'll be first and 10 from the 35 yard line. <clears throat> I'll move kind of slow here. Uh, I'm also writing down starting times and field positions over here just to kind of keep track of the drives. Uh, what is it uh, at the 35? So Kansas City will be starting at their own 35. Again, this a 1 to 57 on the D10s is going to be a passing play and a 58 to 100 is going to be a running play <clears throat> so a zero zero i'm counting as those are my tens so that's going to be a 100 this will be a running play a 12 is going to be a slant so a little run off tackle for three yards so that's going to take us to the 38 yard line every running play or completed pass is 30 seconds and every incomplete pass is going to be 15 seconds. <clears throat> so second down and seven. This is, and I'm reading blue first, so that's a 16. So this is going to be a pass play. And we have a 1-1, one, one, which is an offensive penalty. For the penalties, we just roll the two D6 dice. And we check the offense. So a 35. That's going to be a, a five-yard penalty. So we go back to the 33. I'm just leaving everything as is as far as time is concerned and all that. So uh, it's going to be second down and 12 now for the Chiefs. 22 is going to be another pass. And a 23 is going to be a play action pass to the tight end. And the tight end uh, is going to be to Kelsey. Kelsey's uh, 1 to 8 is Kelsey. And 9 to 10 is Gray, who's the backup tight end. So a play action pass to Kelsey. And that's going to be good for 10 yards. And that brings up... Third down and two for the Chiefs. So third and two from their own 43. And 84 is going to be a running play. 56 is going to be another penalty on the offense. So the Chiefs can't quite get out of their own way here. And that's going to be for a minus 15 yards, which would be some sort of unsportsmanlike. So 10 and then 15. So third down, everything stays the same. <clears throat> third down and 17 to go. Uh, 10, 20, 19, 18, 17, right? And this is going to be a 96. That's going to be a running play as they keep it safe. And that'll be a dive ahead for one yard. That's ultra safe. And you can go ahead and call plays. Just kind of showing you uh, how things go here. So it's going to bring up 4th and 16. 
and they're going to punt. <clears throat> but you could simply call out a pass and just ignore that first <clears throat> initial roll. So this is going to be a pump play. We're looking here, a 23 um, is going to be for 43 yards. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 1, 2, 3. So Minnesota is going to pick it up here at the 28, and we'll see what kind of uh, punt return they have. A 16 on a punt return is going to be for 7 yards, so it's out to the 35. So Minnesota starts their first drive at the 35 on punts who take off 15 seconds. So 43 yards on the punt, uh, 7 yards on the return. <clears throat> Give me just a second to figure out the timing here. So 13. So a minute 45 off the clock and Minnesota's going to take over with uh, 14 minutes, 13 minutes left at their own 35. All right. So here we go, Minnesota with the ball, first and 10 at their own 35 yard line. One to 65 is gonna be a pass, a 59 is going to be a pass. So that's a 24, 24, that's gonna be a, a medium pass to the halfback and it's a pass to Alexander Madison. So that's gonna be for 12 yards. So 10, 11, 12. Takes it out to the 47. Brings up first and 10 from their own 47. <clears throat> Got a 24. This is going to be another pass. 25. That's going to be good to the wide receiver, uh, Justin Jefferson, as they target Jefferson for 15. It's going to be 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And already out to the 38-yard line of Kansas City. First and 10 from the Kansas City 38 as Minnesota putting together a nice little first drive. A 55 is going to be another pass. A 46 is going to be good also for 17 yards. That goes back to Jefferson as Kansas City is having a hard time locating Jefferson on the field. So this is 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So down to the Kansas City 21. And the Vikings are in business just outside the red zone. 76 is going to be a pass, and that's going to, I mean, a run. This is their first run of the game. That's going to be a dive play straight up the middle for no yards. So take the time off the clock, move the down, and it's going to go to second down and 10. <clears throat> 75, another running play. 56, this is going to be an offensive penalty. So first penalty of the game for Minnesota, and that's going to be a loss of five yards. So be a false start one two three four so out to the 26 and no time off the clock or anything so second down and 15 for the Vikings 18 is going to be a pass play a 55 is going to be incomplete so 15 seconds off and it's going to be third down and 15 this is an instance where I'm going to go ahead and do uh, a pass play and then you know into the future I'll do it for Kansas City as well so this will be a pass, so we're ignoring these two. Uh, we're just going to do a 36 off of the passing chart, and that's going to be incomplete as Kirk Cousins can't deliver. And that is going to set up a 4th and 15. Vikings are going to kick the field goal here. That's going to be uh, 36, 43 yards. <coughs> you can see <coughs> on our field goal chart here that anything under 40 goes all the way to the green. And then if it's 40 to 49 yards, then it... Uh, it has to be a 15, uh, one five or greater. Uh, so these two are going to count as a miss on a 40 to 49. I couldn't find a real great way to do just a single column. So that's what I did. So these two are misses on a 49, uh, 40 to 49 yard field goal. And these two are misses, uh, from 40 to 50 plus. So for a 50 yard field goal, you have to at least get to here. I uh, don't need all these. It's Greg Joseph. 
lined up for the kick. It's a 15, and a 15 is going to be just good. So he puts it just inside the uprights from 43 yards. <clears throat> and we're going to take 15 seconds off of the play. So 10-15 is 2 minutes and 45 seconds. And Minnesota takes a 3 nothing lead over Kansas City. <clears throat> All right, so Minnesota kicking off. You can see the game doesn't play particularly difficult. Um, but you get, you know, you get a good feel and flavor of the game. 34 on a kickoff is going to be a touchback. So at the 25 is where KC starts. And on a touchback, there's no time off the clock. So that's going to be 10-15 left in the first quarter and Kansas City starts at their own 25. All right, Mahomes leads the Chiefs out to the field and they are set for their first play. 35 is going to be a pass and that's a sack. Loss of three yards on the play. So go down to the 22 now. Sack on the play as <coughs> Minnesota is able to get home. Uh, another pass play as Mahomes drops back in the shotgun and he delivers a strike to uh, Moore. <clears throat> and that's going to be good for 17 yards. So 10 and then 7 is out to the 39. That'll bring up first down and 10 from their own 39 yard line. Nice strike there from Patrick Mahomes. Uh, this is going to be another pass play as Mahomes... Uh, drops back for a short pass to the wide receiver. That's more again as they are They have a nice little connection going and A 14 that's good for seven yards. So it takes it out to the 46 it's gonna be second down and three for Kansas City A zero three is another pass. That's uh, 56. That'll be a defensive penalty. So let's see what the penalty is on the defense uh, 23 is on a pass. 23 is going to be a five yard. Uh, so it's a plus five. So that's going to give them. So one, two, three, four, five. That'll be a first down. As Minnesota gives them a first down. And no time off the clock. So first and 10 at the Minnesota 49 as they creep just past midfield. A 96. This would be a running play. 13 is going to be a halfback draw, but they get stuffed for minus two yards. So this is going to go back to the other side of the field. And it will be second down and 12 for Kansas City. Uh, 79, that's going to be another running play. 26, this one more successful as Mahomes with the design quarterback draw. Picks up three yards. One, two, three, and that puts it out to the 48. Third down and nine coming. And we're going to get a uh, pass play here from Mahomes in the offense. Pass play, 66. That's going to be another sack as they lose three more. One, two, three. And Minnesota covers them up and is not able to... Uh, Mahomes can't get the pass off. And that's going to bring up fourth down and 10, 11, 12. So fourth down and 12 is going to lead to another Kansas City punt. As the Minnesota defense stiffening up here, the punt is a 56, and that's going to be good for 56 yards, so a boomer. 10, 20, 30, 40, 56 is into the end zone, and Minnesota's going to take over first and 10 at their own 20. So the punt is 56 yards and a touchback. So we'll take off 15 seconds for that. That is a 3 minute and a 15 second drive that basically goes nowhere for Kansas City. Minnesota is going to take over in the first quarter with uh, 7 minutes left at their own 20 yard line. <clears throat> Let's 
situated here. All right. First and 10 for Minnesota. Seven minutes left in the first quarter. Minnesota up 3 nothing at this point. This is going to be a running play. A 46 is going to be an off-tackle play. Good for 11 yards. So Madison uh, picks up 11 on the play. So 10-11 out to the 31. And that's going to bring up first and 10 from their own 31. <clears throat> Another running play as Kevin O'Connell sticks with the run, 35, and he is rewarded. That's a counter play, good for six yards. And that's going to be second down and four from the 37 for the Vikings. 99 is going to be another running play as they are forcing it down their throat. That's another counter play for six yards. And that will take the ball out to the 43. Brings up first and 10 from the Minnesota 43, six or five and a half minutes left in the first quarter. This will be a pass as they throw a quick wide receiver screen out to Justin Jefferson. And Jefferson takes it for five yards. So that takes it up to the 48. It'll be second down and five um, for the Vikings. 0-3, another pass as Kirk Cousins drops back. A little three-step drop out to the wide receiver. This is to Jefferson again. And he is going to pick up, what is it, 14? As he's going to pick up seven yards on the play. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So just beyond the sticks. And they pick up the first down. It'll be first and 10 from the other side of the field. Kansas City 45, Minnesota driving at the end of the uh, first quarter. Excuse me. Uh, Kirk Cousins drops back again. This time a little button hook over the middle as uh, that goes to Addison who exploits the zone and he settles down for a completion that's going to be good for seven yards and that takes it out to the 38. It'll be second down and three for Minnesota. 81. This will be a running play. So a running play That'll be a slant, so off the tackle, uh, outside for 10 yards. And that's a good gashing play for first down. Three minutes and 30 seconds left in the first quarter. Minnesota driving on Kansas City. They're already up 3 nothing, and let's see if they can seal the deal. Another running play. This is going to be a slant play. Another one that's been working for them for three yards. So that's down to the 25, and three minutes left in the quarter. It brings up second down and seven. Uh, 66 on a pass play. 66 is going to be a sack as they take uh, a sack. So they give back three, and it's going to be third down and 10. Vikings are going to be passing the ball on third and long. So this is a 26. 26 on the pass play is trips to the left, and we got a wide receiver pass. Addison is open on the deep end and they hit it for 15 yards as they only needed 10 so 10 11 12 13 14 15 takes the ball down to the 13 we are in the first quarter and there are two minutes left that's a first down pickup for the Vikings Minnesota driving they're in the red zone <clears throat> 55 is going to be another pass uh, 16 is going to be an empty set as they go five wide and they get it to the wide receiver uh, Justin Jefferson for nine yards and that'll take the ball down to the four they can still pick up a first down without getting a touchdown second down and nine this will be another pass play a 14 is going to be a short pass to the wide receiver in the back corner of the end zone and that is going to be a touchdown for Addison from four yards that is uh, Kirk Cousins to Addison for a TD pass of four yards and the home crowd is loving it uh, we're gonna take off so that this is down to the one minute mark six minute drive for the Vikings as they line up for the PAT and there's only one miss on the PAT and that's the snake eyes and so they hit it there that's gonna be a 10 nothing lead for Minnesota as they'll be kicking off to Kansas City with 
a minute left in the first quarter. <clears throat> Kickoff here from Minnesota, a 14. Uh, really need to put another set over here or in the middle maybe or both. So 14 is going to be good for 62 yard kickoff so that's down to uh, the 3 and Kansas City will be running the ball back so it'll take 15 seconds. 44 is a 60 yard run back so huge run back for Kansas City, big play, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 60 yards. So out to the Minnesota 37, as that's just a huge play in the game. Kansas City will take over with 45 seconds left in the quarter, and they are already at the Minnesota 37. So a great opportunity here for Mahomes and the Chiefs to get back into this one. And maybe a momentum shifting play. This would be a running play. And that's going to be a halfback counter for two yards. And that goes to Edwards Hilaire as he picks up two. It'll be second down and eight. This will be the last play of the quarter. 57 just into the pass range. So this will be a 34. And that is going to be incomplete as Mahomes get connect on the pass. And that takes us to the second quarter. Um, set up the quarters here. So it'll be KC, Minnesota. And it is 10 nothing, Minnesota as we head to the second quarter of play. And it is third down and eight to go for, for Kansas City. We have a pass play here from Mahomes in the offense. Uh, this will be a 35. 35 is going to be another incompletion. And that brings up uh, a testy situation here. Uh, we've got... That's a 45. That's a 52-yard field goal. Let's go ahead and go for the field goal and try to get some points on the board. Remember, it has to be here. It has to be at least a 22 or better. So we'll see if they can hit on the 50-yard field goal. And a 22. Wow. As Bucker just gets it across the crossbar. Oh, that's from 52 yards. Bucker is good. And... That takes another 15 off, so we're at 14.30. So that's a, a minute and 15 seconds for the score. And it is 10 to three. They had great field position. Only gained two yards on the drive, but Harrison Bucker bails them out with the huge field goal. So Minnesota is going to receive the ball. This will be their first possession of the second quarter. And they'll take over. Uh, we'll see how much time there is. Minnesota up 10 to 3 now. Uh, a 15 on a kickoff is going to be 61 yards. So that goes to the 4. 60 yards is here. 61, 2, 3, 4, 65 yards is to the goal line. Uh, and that's what we have. We have sort of those. And then the rest are going to be touchbacks. The touchback percentage in the NFL is about 60% or so. So all of these statistics are statistically accurate to, uh, to the number of penalties, the number of fumbles and interceptions and sacks. And, you know, I went through everything. Some of these uh, penalty yards are just, you'll recognize some of them. So 15 yards or five yards or 10 yards, obviously is going to be like a holding call. Uh, so you can, what I like about this is you can kind of create the narrative as you go along. I've given you some prompts here. Uh, as far as what type of play it is. And so you can create a little bit of the narrative uh, while you're playing. Um, so try to do that as much as possible. 
So the kickoff goes down to the four yard line and Minnesota with the return. 24 is going to be for 24 yards and that'll take it out to the 28. So Minnesota starts at their own 28 yard line with 14, 15 left in the half. And let's see if the Vikings can drive the ball. Their last possession ended with the TD pass to Addison. <clears throat> 17 is going to be a passing play as Kirk uh, gets it out to the wide receiver. This will be to Addison again, and he goes for five yards. So out to the 33. That'll bring up second down and five for Minnesota. I like this little player finder kind of basic, but it gives you the flavor of the game, and uh, it's kind of cool. 22 as Kirk Cousins drops back, and he fires a strike right to the defense. And that's going to be a pick, and that will end at the line of scrimmage minus 15. So the 33 minus 15 is going to be to the 18. So 10 plus 5 is to the 33 red. So at the 18 is where Kansas City is going to take over. And we're going to call that 15 seconds on the play. So INT for Kurt. And 15, 15, one minute off the clock, and they turn it over deep in their own territory. Kansas City is going to take over <clears throat> at the 18-yard line for Minnesota. And not good. The last two Kansas City drives have started pretty deep in Minnesota territory. And we'll see if the defense can hold or not. 39 is going to be a pass play. 23 is going to go for a play action pass to the tight end. This time he throws it to the backup tight end, Gray. And that goes for 10 yards. So down to the 8, it's going to be first and goal for Kansas City. As they are inside the Minnesota 10. A 9 is going to be a pass play. 34 is going to be incomplete. And that brings up second down and 10. Second goal, sorry. For the Chiefs. Another pass. 44 is going to be a sack. As Mahomes runs around, he takes the sack. They'll be at the 14-yard line. Uh, it'll be third and goal um, from the 14. Going to have a pass play here. Let's see if Mahomes has got a little magic in him. That was a terrible sack to take. Uh, 25 is going to be a pass out of the Twins formation. That's a pass that he gets out to Moore. And that's for 15 yards. And that's going to be good for a score. Uh, what I do is I take 14 and then I add 10 for the end zone. So you've got a 24, a 1 to 24 yard window. Or a, uh, 14 to 24 yard window. If your result is inside that 24 yards, then you are good. If it's outside, then that goes for an incomplete pass, like you're throwing it out of the end zone. So you have to get inside the window uh, because there's some big plays here. So you just got to get inside the window. And if you're inside there, you know, and you hit on one of these big plays, I just want to make it a little bit more of a challenge to score. Uh, but this is clearly inside the window. It's a 25, and that's going to be go for 15 yards. And that is a pass to Moore for a touchdown from the 14. So Patrick Mahomes does come through on third and goal. And he he lands the TD pass for 14 yards. And just like that, don't know if I move this or not, so I'll move it. Um, just like that, Kansas City storms back, and they're going to... Most likely tie this game. Let's take the extra point. Oh, ho, 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 just missed it or just made it. And uh, we are at 11.30 left in the game. So that means um, one minute and 45 seconds to score. And I do keep track of time of possession just for my own purposes and uh, just checking the game mostly. So we got a kickoff coming to Minnesota. 11.30 left in the half. Kansas City has tied this one up. 33. 
is going to be a touchback. And Minnesota will start at their own 25-yard line. No time off the clock on a touchback. All right, Vikes, let's put together a little drive here. They've got 11 and a half minutes left in the half. Let's see if they can get the ball down the field. Um, it's going to be an 88. 88 is a running play. 15, that's going to be a dive for no yards. So right up the gut and didn't get anything as they get stuffed by the Kansas City defensive line. Brings up second down and 10. This will be a pass play. 16 is going to be an empty set. He gets it to uh, the wide receiver, KJ Osborne. And that's going to go for nine yards. That's going to bring up second or third down and one for Minnesota. Going to choose a run play here. Let's see if we can pick up the first down. <clears throat> Double sixes on a rush. He is going to be a wide receiver reverse as a gutsy call on third and one. And that will be um, Jefferson on the the reverse maybe we'll call it a jet sweep that goes for 13 yards so 10 11 12 13 out to the 47 yard line and what a call by kevin mcconnell and the offense as minnesota takes over first and 10 at their own 47 79 is going to be another running play as they stick with the run they go off tackle for 11 more yards and that takes it down to the 42 yard line of the Chiefs, first and ten from enemy territory. <clears throat> Another run. This one will be a dive straight ahead, and they're going to lose a yard on that. And it's going to be second down and eleven for Minnesota as we are drip, drip, dripping our way to the end of the half. Minnesota in Kansas City territory at the forty-three. It's second and eleven. A uh, fifty-nine is going to be a pass play as Kirk drops back, and he gets a quick screen out to the right. And that will be to K.J. Osborne, who takes it for a gain of five yards. So it'll be third down and six. Third and six for Minnesota. And let's, uh, let's go ahead and throw the ball on third down and six. This is considered third and long. Uh, 24 is going to be a completed pass to the halfback. A little swing pass out to the right. And that is going to be good. The halfback is Madison as he fights and claws 12 yards for the first down. That takes it down to the Kansas City 26. Excuse me, eight minutes left in the first half. First and 10, Minnesota from the Kansas City 26. 48 is another pass play this time. 55 yards, or 55 yards, 55 is going to be an incomplete pass as Kirk misses a receiver. Brings up second down and 10. Here's another run play. As I go back to the run, this is a quarterback draw, a design draw for Kirk Cousins. Definitely caught him off guard. Kirk doesn't run a lot, but that takes it down to the 18-yard line to bring up a third and short uh, for Minnesota. We're going to leave the whole playbook open for him here. See what they can do. 81 is going to be a running play. 35 is going to be a counter, and that goes for six yards. So one, two, three, four, five, six, down to the 12. Uh, Minnesota can still score without getting a touchdown, but they do have first and 10 from the red zone at the 12 yard line. Knocking at the door, and this is going to be a pass play. A 34 is going to be incomplete as Kirk can't connect. Takes us down to six and a half minutes left in the half. Second down and 10 for the Vikings. Another pass play, 33, another incompletion. And a tough set here from the 12 for Minnesota as they are in danger of stalling. Another pass play, a 12 is going to be a wide receiver screen. They go back to Justin Jefferson on the screen, hoping to pop one. And they can only get it as far as the nine yard line. That's going to bring up third down and seven for Minnesota and they're going to set up for the field goal try. It'll be a 30, so 29, 36 yard field goal. So all the way to the top of the green there is what we got as Joseph lines it up and he drills it. So that'll be a field goal from 36 yards. 
and that uh, gives Minnesota the 13 to 10 lead five and a half minutes left in the half that was a six minute drive and just stellar work from Kirk Cousins and the offense to take that one from uh, their own 25 <clears throat> 5.30 left in the second period, or the second quarter. Minnesota will be kicking off. <clears throat> That's a 26. And a 26 is going to be good for a touchback, as Joseph puts that one in the end zone. And Kansas City will take over first and 10 from their own 25. No time off the clock there. And we got five and a half minutes left in the half. And let's see if Pat Mahomes can bring his boys down the field. First and ten for the Chiefs. A 65 is going to be a running play. And that'll be a halfback draw trying to surprise them. But they actually get stuffed behind the line of scrimmage. That'll bring up second down and 12. <clears throat> Uh, here is a pass play from Mahomes, and that's going to be a wide receiver screen that goes out to Moore. They're going to pick up five on the play, puts out to the 28, and that brings up third down and seven for the Chiefs. That's who they are. Third and seven for the Chiefs, four and a half minutes left in the quarter. Uh, let's go ahead and... Uh, Roll the dice, literally, and let's some play out. 31 is going to be a pass play. A 56 is a defensive penalty. So, big penalty here on Minnesota. And a 23 on a pass play is going to be plus 5 yards. So, we had maybe an encroachment. Uh, we'll say that goes out to the 33. Brings up third down and two now. And uh, whew, that was a big one. Went from third and long to third and very short. Uh, 68 is going to be a running play as they test the Minnesota offensive line off tackle and they pick up the first down out to the 37 as they get just beyond the sticks. Four minutes left in the half in this one. <clears throat> Minnesota, I'm sorry, uh, Kansas City with the ball driving down the field. They're at their own 37 first and 10. 56 is going to be a pass that goes for 33 and that is... Incomplete from Mahomes. <clears throat> he tried to get it out to uh, Tony. And yeah, missed on that one. This will be a running play. 14 is going to be a dive. And they're going to lose a yard. So that's going to be uh, not a great play. Trying to run it up the gut. And yeah, Minnesota says no, no, no. Alright, from the 36. Third down and 11. So third and long. We're going to have a pass play here. A 44 is going to be a sack as Minnesota covers them up. And we're going to lose six more here down to the 30. Uh, that takes us to 245 left in the half. And they're going to get another punt from Kansas City as uh, Minnesota's defense, third sack of the day on Pat Mahomes. And their defense is really keeping them in this one. An 11 on a punt is... Ooh, a pump block. So it's going to be the line of scrimmage minus 15. So they get the pump block after the sack. And Minnesota is just loving it. So 10 down to the 15. It's going to be first and 10 Minnesota at their own or at the Kansas City 15. And uh, on a punt, we'll take off 15. So we'll say a pump block. And that will take us down to two and a half minutes. So three minutes on the drive. Minnesota poised to put more points on the board here. They lead 13 to 10. We have two and a half minutes left in the half. Once we get into the red here, everything's going to be uh, 15 seconds unless we say otherwise. A 24 is going to be a pass. A 46 is going to be from the shotgun as Kirk Cousins drops back. And he puts one out to Justin Jefferson for the TD in the back of the end zone. You can see we're on the 15. That's a 17-yard gain. And that goes for a one-play touchdown for Minnesota as they shove it in the face of the Kansas City Chiefs. And that only took 15 seconds. So they take over uh, with 
2.30 left. Sorry, I didn't figure all this out. From the Kansas City 15, that's going to be a TD pass. From Cousins to Justin Jefferson, and JJ makes a play from 14 yards out. And it only takes 15 seconds. So let's see about the extra point. And a 13 means the extra point is good. And that's going to be a 20 to 10 lead for Minnesota as they kick off to Kansas City with a little more than two minutes left. So on this play, it'll be the two minute warning. <clears throat> if there's a run back, I guess. So Minnesota kicking off. And what a turn of events on the block punt. 25. 25 is going to be good for a touchback, and Kansas City will take over at their own 25 uh, with 2 minutes and 15 seconds left. All right. Kansas City is uh, poised to just be throwing the ball here, and so they're going to try to go down and score best they can. So we're going to ignore, uh, that was a six, we're going to ignore these in terms of play call, and we're just going to go with the pass here. 56 is going to be a defensive penalty as Minnesota starts it off with a 10-yard penalty. So holding on the pass play, and they're going to take that. So that's going to be first and 10 from the 35, didn't have to run a play. <clears throat> For the sake of this game, I'm not taking any time off the clock or uh, anything else. So, on penalties. You can make up your own plays. You can do actual, you know, you can run a play and see, you know, did he complete it or whatever. Uh, that's totally up to you. I'm just playing penalties as no time off the clock. Take the yardage and then replay the down. Uh, 25 is going to be a wide receiver a pass to the wide receiver this goes to rice uh, i believe his first catch of the game that's going to go for 15 yards so 10 15 takes it out to the 50 yard line and kansas city is rocking and rolling two minutes left in the game we come back from the two minute warning and kansas city is driving there at the 50. a 13 on a pass is going to be a short pass to gray the backup tight end and that goes for six yards. So it takes it down to the 44-yard line of Minnesota. Like I said, once you get inside this red, and it says it here, uh, kind of small. You'll have to really look at it. But uh, it says all plays less than two minutes in the second and fourth quarters are 15 seconds. So that pass to Gray. Uh, they get into the hurry-up offense. And it's going to be another passing play. This time it's going to be incomplete. Uh, that's going to stop the clock. And it will be third down and four. So let's see what they got. Another pass play, a 23. That's going to be a play action pass. So they fake the run and they get it out to Kelsey for a gain of 10 yards. That takes it down to the 34-yard line of Minnesota. That's a first down. And they hurry up to the line of scrimmage. Trying to get some kind of score on the board. Another 33 is going to be another incompletion. That'll stop the clock, but we're down to one minute left in the half. Second down and 10 for Kansas City. <clears throat> Chiefs down 20 to 10, looking for some kind of score here. Uh, 12 is going to be a good pass out to the wide receiver, Moore. Moore picks up five yards, and that takes it down to the 29 uh, with the 24 to go. Um... And that will be third down and five. Third and five for the Chiefs. <clears throat> 56. 56 is going to be a defensive penalty on the play. So before the snap, we have a five-yard penalty. And that's going to give a cheapo, cheapo first down. Good Lord. All right, so uh, no time off the clock there. Still 45 seconds left. And... Mahomes is able to draw them off sides. And we have first and 10 from the 24. Uh, 55 on a pass is going to be incomplete. That brings up second down and 10 from the 24. 
Pat Mahomes still throwing the ball. 56, another penalty on the Vikings. A 34 is on a pass play five yards, so they give five yards again. Uh, takes it down to the 19-yard line, and everything stays the same. Second down and five from inside the red zone. Uh, 44 is going to be a sack. Oh, you can't take that sack right there, Mahomes. So minus six, that's the big sack too. So that takes it out to the 25. That's going to bring up third down and uh, long. So 10, 11 yards to go. And Kansas City is going to use, they got one more play left here. They're going to use that play to kick a field goal as Mahomes frustrated with himself. Uh, couldn't find an open man and had to take the sack. And didn't throw it away. So this is going to be a 35-42 uh, yard field goal. So again, these two top green ones are going to be a miss. Lining upward is Butker. The kick is up. And it is good. As Butker drills it from uh, 42 yards. And that takes us down to the half. Uh, which is a 2 minute and 15 second drive. The Chiefs do come away with points, uh, which is good because they're not going to get the ball first in the second half. It's going to be Minnesota with the ball coming out of the half. And at the half, it is 20 to 13 Minnesota. Uh, Minnesota scores 10, and the Chiefs get 13 in the second quarter. And... I think I'm just going to keep going here. Uh, got a pretty good game going, 20 to 13. We'll see what the second half has for us. As we start the third quarter, Minnesota is going to get the ball first as Kansas City kicks off from their own 35. Again, with this game, just trying to. Um, just trying to have like an easy to play game. It's one sheet and some dice. You know, it's just not a difficult game. I could see, you know, this being uh, the season and maybe even having uh, some defensive players if you wanted to or, you know, but mostly just keeping track of, you know, their run pass ratios and stuff like that. You can see that the game plays fair. Uh, we've had one turnover and that was an interception of Kirk Cousins. Uh, I've had two, three, four field goal attempts and some pass, uh, passing TDs. Haven't had a rushing TD yet, but uh, neither team rushes the ball a whole lot. And we're going to start with uh, Kansas City kicking off to Minnesota here in the second half. A 14. And that's going to go for 62 yards. So that takes it down to the three. So Minnesota coming back with the kick return 35 on the kick return is going to be for 28 yards that's out to the 31 so Minnesota takes over first and 10 at their own 31 we'll take off 15 seconds there and it's 1445 left in the third whenever they take over at the their own 31 yard line so Minnesota up 20 to 10 Looking to add points here. This is going to be a drop back pass for Kirk Cousins. It's short and out to the flat. Seven yards to Justin Jefferson. And just like that, the offense is back and rolling. Second down and three. Uh, a 40 is going to be another pass. 12 is going to be good. A wide receiver screen. This time he gets it out to KJ Osborne on the outside. That's going to go for five yards and Osborne picks up the first down. First and 10 from the Minnesota 43. A 94, that's going to be a running play. And that'll be a quarterback draw. They catch him again on the quarterback draw. And this goes for uh, seven, eight yards. And that'll bring up second down and two for Minnesota. Now the pass play, a 34 is going to be incomplete from Kirk Cousins. That'll bring up third down and two for the Vikes. They are into Kansas City territory, just barely. 
and this will be another pass play. A 34 is going to be incomplete as he can't complete over the middle. And that brings up fourth down and two from the 49. Um, Vikings have a seven point lead. Let's go ahead and punt the ball. Uh, this may go into the end zone for a touchback, but we'll see. Uh, 44 is a boomer of a kick, 58 yards. So that's going to go um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 49. So 49 yard punt. And a touchback. So 15 seconds off there, 12 and a half minutes are going to be left in the uh, third quarter. And that's a 2 minute and 15 second drive. So Kansas City, down a touchdown, has a nice little stand there. And they will take over first and 10 at their own 20. Pat Mahomes leads the offense onto the field. A 59 is going to be a running play. 35 is a nice little counter play for six yards. Good call by Andy Reid, second down and four for Kansas City. This will be another running play as they go for 10 yards on the slant, and that will take the ball out to the 36, first and 10 as that is Pacheco uh, with the 10 yard game. <clears throat> going into the air this time, that's gonna be another sack as Minnesota gets the, uh, the six yard sack, get to Mahomes on that play. And that's gonna bring up second down and 16 for Kansas City. 64, that'll be a running play. That's off tackle for four yards. Not gonna put a huge dent into things, but uh, it's now third down and 12. We're gonna get a pass play here. A 23 on a pass is gonna be a play action pass to Kelsey, the tight end, and they're gonna pick up 10, and that's gonna be not enough for the first down. So that's gonna bring up fourth down and two, and Kansas City's gonna have to punt here. So they took over at their own 20, and they took over with the, uh, a moment and a half left. And now there is 10. All right, so let's see what the punt is for Kansas City. Fifteen yards on the punt is going to be thirty-nine yards, so not a great kick. Uh, Ten, twenty, thirty—that would be forty. So that's thirty-nine. So out to the seventeen, and then return for Minnesota. Uh, is a fifty-five. A fifty-five is a huge return. That's going to be for forty yards. As 10, 20, 30, 40, out to the Kansas City 43 as they get past midfield before the returner is pushed out of bounds. That's going to be a 15 seconds off the clock. Minnesota is going to take over first and 10. Uh, it's 2.45 on the drive. Minnesota takes over first and 10 with 9.45 left in the quarter. And they're going to be at the Kansas City 43. So great field position for the Vikings. As Kirk Cousins smell in blood. They're up 20 to 13. Uh, 41 is going to be a pass play. A 22. Oh my gosh. It's another pick. As Kirk Cousins lets one fly. And that is another pick. This is line of scrimmage plus 15. So it's this way toward the Kansas City. Um... Kansas City goal line and that's going to be just a killer so 10 and then 15 is out to the 28 Yeesh. actually 
I'm gonna call that 30 seconds of the play. All right, 2013, a vintage year. It will be uh, nine minutes and 15 seconds left in the quarter. And Kansas City is gonna be taking over at their own 28 as they make the stand. Second pick of the day for the venerable Kirk Cousins. Upset with himself. I'm upset with him. All right, third down. I mean, uh, first down and 10 for Kansas City as their offense trots right back onto the field. We'll see how this treats the uh, Minnesota defense. A 56 on a run is going to be an offensive penalty, though, as Kansas City uh, with the five yard penalty, like an illegal motion or something. So they're going to go back to the 23. It's been a little bit of a penalty ridden game for Kansas City. And they've given up uh, three or four sacks as well. So. Tough offensive game for the Chiefs. I wish that was a little bit more how it was whenever the game this game was played just a couple of weeks ago. Uh, 16 on a pass play is going to be empty set. And they get the ball out to their number one, which is Rice. And he's going to go for nine yards. So that's going to be a nine-yard gain out to the 32. That leaves uh, six to go, so it's going to be... Second down and six. And let's go ahead and move that the appropriate amount. <clears throat> Second down and six for Pat Mahomes. This is going to be a running play called from the sideline. Uh, that's a dive straight ahead for zero yards. And uh, that's a tough one. It'll bring up third down and long. Third and six. Kind of a pass play here from the Chiefs. That will be a 12. A 12 is going to be a wide receiver screen for five yards. That goes to Moore, and that's only going to take it out to the 37. That brings up fourth down and one, and uh, Andy Reid chomping at the bit to go for this, but he's not going to go for it as he is going to send out the punting unit to give up a score here. Might put the game out of the way, but they have flipped the field position. Maybe Kurt will throw him, uh, Kirk, Kirk will throw him another interception. So let's see what the punt uh, distance is. Andy's looking for a boomer here. And instead, he gets a 50 yarder, not too bad. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, plus 1 is out to the 12. And let's see about the run back. So 51 on the punt. <clears throat> 13 on the run back is going to be just a four yard run back so that's going to be first and ten at their own 16 for minnesota good coverage on the play nice high punt and deep and we'll take our 15 off there so seven and a half minutes left in the quarter uh, means that is a one minute and 45 second drive still 2013 uh, no score yet in the second half 2013 was our score at the half Minnesota with the ball. This will be a running play. 56 is going to be an offensive penalty on Minnesota. We get a 15. 15 on a running play is going to be 5 yards as they get a false start. Takes it back to the 11. It's going to be first down and 15 for Minnesota. <clears throat> this will be a pass play from Kirk. That's a short pass to uh, Jordan Addison and that is for seven yards so that takes it out to the 18 that's gonna bring up second down and eight for Minnesota second down play for the Minnesota offense uh, this is uh, another drop back pass for Kirk twins left and he gets it to the wide receiver, uh, Addison again, who is open for 15 yards. So nice pick up there. So that's 10 and 15 takes it out to the 33. And it'll be first and 10 Minnesota from their own 33 yard line. Little pitch and catch, little pitch and catch. This is going to be a running play. 45 is a slant. That's good off tackle for 10 yards. And that'll be another first down for the bikes. 
And we head out to the 43 yard line, first and 10. Six minutes left in the third quarter. 20 to 13 is our score. The Vikings driving and trying to extend their lead if possible. This is a halfback screen for eight yards. That's going to go to Alexander Madison. Nice pickup out there. Uh, so seven, eight. And they get just to the other side of midfield. It'll be second down and two from the Kansas City 49. Another pass play, 44, is going to be for a sack, and that's just a killer. Oh, that's a killer. One, two, three, four, five, six, back to the 45. Oh, my gosh. So it's third and eight, and uh, just can't take that sack. Oof. Kurt couldn't find anybody open. So third down and eight, and Minnesota is going to go ahead and throw the ball here. 26. Kirk redeems himself. He gets it out to JJ, catches it for 10, and runs for 5. And that's going to be uh, first down for Minnesota as they go for 10, 15 yards and the first down. Nice play from Cousins to Jefferson. Lyon gave him some time, and he delivered. And Jefferson, with the big run after catch, gets him to the 40. First and 10 from Kansas City's 40-yard line. This will be a, another pass play at 13. It's going to be a short pass to the tight end. This will go to uh, Hawkinson, I believe his first catch of the day. And that will be good for six yards. Down to the 34-yard line goes Minnesota. Second and four at the Kansas City 34. Kansas City desperately trying to hold on and keep any kind of score from happening. There's going to be a pass play, another halfback screen. Uh, this time up the middle. And that goes to Madison again. It's going to be good for eight yards. That takes it down to the 26. So it'll be first and 10 Minnesota from just outside the red zone. <clears throat> Three and a half minutes left in the third. And Minnesota driving. This will be another pass play. A 24 is going to be good as he throws one over the middle to... Alexander Madison again. Madison, a key target on this one. And that's going to go for 12 yards. So 10, 11, 12. And that'll bring up first and 10 from inside the Kansas City red zone. And we'll see if Minnesota can put it in here. Last time it was a touchdown in the corner to Jefferson. Let's see what happens here. Uh, 57 is going to be another pass. 24 is going to be another pass to the running back. And this time a swing out to the right. He makes a couple of people miss. And he takes it down to the two-yard line for 12 yards. It'll be first and goal. Minnesota as Alexander Madison showing a little shake and bake out there. All right, let's let's uh, let's go for the run play here. See if we can punch it in. And 34 on the running play off tackle. That's going to go for a two-yard score. And Minnesota is in for the TD run of two yards. And takes us down to the two-minute warning. Uh, they took over with uh, so 8.15, 7.30. So another huge drive for the Vikings. So punt of 51 yards. I don't know where they took over. I get wrapped up in the, in the game and I forget to keep all the stats. Five minute and 30 second drive. So the drives for the Vikings have been quite long. And uh, I wish it had gone like this in the actual game. Instead they fumbled it away really. Uh, they kept the game within seven. But boy, <clears throat> they just fumbled the game away. Uh, 36 is going to be good on the extra point, And that will be 27-13 our score here in Minnesota. With KC getting the ball back. Down 14. They are in need of some offense. <clears throat> All right, so two minutes left in the third quarter. Minnesota up 27-13. And let's see what the kickoff holds. 34. Get out of there. 34 is going to be a touchback. And... Kansas City is going to have to take over at their own 25-yard line. It'll be first and 10 with two minutes left. Um, 
with their own 25. First and 10, Kansas City. We got a 40. A 40 is going to be a pass as Pat Mahomes <clears throat> gets it out to the running back. And the running back is Edwards Hilaire with the catch and run. And that's going to be good for 12 yards as they get it out to the 37-yard line. First and 10 for the Chiefs. Nice start. Here is another pass. A 55 is going to be incomplete. So that's going to set up second down and 10 from the Chiefs 37. Another pass, a 12-yard pass. That's a wide receiver screen out to Tony. Tony makes one man miss, but it gets engulfed by the entire Minnesota Vikings defense. And that's going to bring up third down and five for Kansas City. 45 seconds left in the third. Uh, that was a 64. Uh, 64 is going to be a running play. And an 11, a 1-1 one, one is going to be an offensive penalty. So... Uh, 14 on a running play is going to be another false start. This time pushes them back to the 37 and no choice but to throw the ball here on third and 10. Another 11. You know what? I messed that up. That was a defensive penalty. So let's roll for the defensive penalty. I'm sorry. A 66. Uh, a penalty on the rush. So that's going to be a 15 yard penalty, some sort of roughing or unsportsmanlike conduct. So it was out here. So we're going to go uh, 10 and then 15. So instead of that, it will be third down. We'll keep it right there. Uh, so it's first down in 10. I believe I did that right for Kansas City. Uh, I. I looked on the wrong side. It was a rushing play, so that's a defensive penalty. All right, uh, 88 is going to be another run. 25 is going to be a dive straight ahead for two yards, and that takes it out to the 39-yard line for Kansas City. Second down and eight for the KC offense. Uh, 25 on a pass will be a twin setup. That's going to be to the wide receiver, Rice. And that's good over the middle for 15 yards, and that'll be a first down. So 10 and 15 is out to here. So Kansas City driving now. They're down by 7. I'm sorry, they're down by 14. And they could really use a score here early uh, going into the fourth quarter. 66, so instead, uh, actually it's a running play, right? 66 on a running play is a wide receiver reverse. And that will be Tony on the reverse and that goes for 13 yards and that will be down to the 11. Um, so first and 10 from the 11 yard line and that's going to take us to the fourth quarter as Kansas City with the ball first and 10 uh, from their own or from the Minnesota 11 and what did we have here we had no scores in that quarter for Kansas City and we had seven for Minnesota. So 27 to 13 is our score in this one. First and 10. Kansas City from the 11 yard line they can score or they can get a first down without scoring this will be a pass play 26 and it doesn't matter here as they go for the touchdown that's a touchdown pass from Mahomes to Tony and just like that Kansas City is back into this one so TD pass uh, from 11 yards Mahomes to Tony and 14 and a half plus two is uh, two minutes and 30 seconds. So they ran down the field on that one. It is the extra point. <laughs> they just barely made it again. 27-20 is our score now with Minnesota getting the ball. And they have the lead 
but uh, that lead has evaporated. So Kansas City looking for a stop here. They'll be kicking off to Minnesota. Fourth quarter, 14 and a half minutes left in this one. And we got a good one going. A 55-yard kick is going to be a touchback. So Minnesota takes over first and 10 at their 25. That's uh, no time off the clock, actually. So let's see if Minnesota can equal the Chiefs. Chiefs started at their own 25 and just scored. And let's see if Minnesota can take it down the field. This is a pass play from Kirk Cousins. 45 is going to be a play action pass to Justin Jefferson and they're going to get him on the corner route and that's going to be good for a first down that'll be 16 yards on the gain so 10 plus 16 is out to the 41 and just like that Minnesota in business first and 10 from their own 41 Kirk Cousins under center this is <coughs> excuse, excuse me this is going to be a running play I mean a pass play Sorry about that. This is going to be a pass play. 55 is going to be an incompletion as he drops back and he misfires. It'll be second down and 10 from the 41. Another pass from Kirk Cousins. Uh, 16 is going to be an empty set and that is out to KJ Osborne for nine yards. And nine yards is going to bring up a third down and one. From the 50 yard line for the Vikings. Vikings up by a touchdown, looking to add to that. 77 is going to be a running play as McConnell dials it up, and that's going to be a dive straight ahead for zero yards, and that'll bring up a, a key fourth down here. Uh, do they go for it? We're going to go for it. Fourth and one. It just takes guts to play this game, and uh, they're going to run the ball again. We'll see if they can uh, get the first down or not. A 36. That's going to be a quarterback draw. <laughs> All right. A uh, quarterback draw for eight yards as Kirk Cousins takes it down to the 42. Definitely nobody saw that one coming. And that'll be a first down pickup for the Vikings. <clears throat> first and 10 from the Kansas City 42. Uh, this will be another running play. This will be a slant play for three yards, and that takes it out to the 39 of Kansas City. 11 minutes and 45 seconds left in the game. Minnesota trying to ice this one away. And they have another pass play and another pick. Uh, Brother Kirk. Brother Kirk. Brother Kirk. Third interception of the day for the Kansas City offense or defense. Uh, that will be a three minute and 15 second drive. Mahomes is going to get the ball with 11:15 left in the in the game and a chance to tie this. So it's going to be a line of scrimmage minus 15. So that's going to be down to the 24. Oh my gosh. Don't be a Vikings fan, people. It's a little bit like being a Cubs fan. You get some exciting times, but boy. They're going to let you down. All right. Minnesota ball. I'm sorry. Uh, Kansas City ball at their own 24. Let's go ahead and mark that down. 11 minutes and 15 seconds left in the half. Or in the, uh, in the second half. And... They'll start at their own 24. Minnesota needs some huge plays here. <clears throat> 55 is going to be a pass play. 46 from Holmes, and that's going to be out of the shotgun. He gets it out to uh, Tony, and that's good for 17 yards. A little seam up the middle. So we're going to go 10, and 17 is out to the 41. They need the, uh, they need the 49 for first down. Kansas City first and 10. Mahomes with the uh, running play. A 22, it's a fumble. And that's going to be Minnesota ball as we get a turnover. That's exactly what we needed. 
And, oh, that's a killer. Not for us, though. All right, so it's going to be the line of scrimmage plus five yards. So at the um, 46. So we're going to take over at the 46-yard line. And, yes, I did say we. I'm a Vikings fan. So I'm going to say we. And so we take over at the 46-yard line. What a huge play. A couple of plays there. Two turnovers in the span of 30 seconds. And it will be 10-15. Uh, That's just a one-minute drive. Sorry, one minute spin. 27 20 is our score. Minnesota's going to get the ball back here in the fourth quarter with 10 minutes and 15 seconds left. And they'll be starting at the Kansas City 46. Huge play in the game. All right. Minnesota. Let's do it too. We're going to start off with a running play. A little predictable. Let's see if it works. Uh, it's a slant off tackle for 10 yards, and that's going to be a first down as Alexander Madison takes it for the first down, carrying the rock in this one. Let's go stick with it. Kevin McConnell just keeps putting the pedal to the metal. Another slant play, 10 yards, 45, and they are pushing it down the field on Kansas City. Kansas City getting a little tired, and we're going to keep pushing on that gas. Another run play, another 45-yard slant. Look at that. That's going to be not a 45, but a 45 on the roll. Here's a 10-yard slant, and they just keep hammering off the outside edge. And 10 yards a pop. <coughs> and let's stay with it. Maybe we'll hit another 45. 24 is going to be a counter, this time just for 2 yards. And that'll bring up 2nd down and 8. Running that clock off, getting yourself in field goal position. This is all good things. <coughs> Another running play. This time, tricking it up with a little reverse. This is uh, Cade, or I'm sorry, Addison with the reverse. 13 yards. That's going to get it down to the one. Tricky, tricky there. And it is 7:45 left in the game. And it'll be first and goal from the one yard line. Let's just keep pressing the gas on this running play. 24. 24 is going to be a halfback counter. Don't know why they're running a counter on the goal line, but it works. That's two yards, and that's going to be another TD run. And this time that goes to uh, Alexander Madison. And Minnesota shoving it down the throats of the Kansas City Chiefs. Um, that'll be for one yard. And that is 7.15 uh, left in the game. That's a three-yard or a three-minute drive. And let's see about the extra point. Come on, Joseph. There you go. 34 20 is our score. Kansas City going to get the ball back. <clears throat> what a turn of events with the, uh, with the turnover there from Kansas City. They had a chance to tie it up, and instead they're down 14 again. <coughs> there is always a chance of a kick return or a TD, so let's see. Uh, don't want to say that too loud. 12 is going to be 64, excuse me, 64 yards on the kick. So that takes it down to the one. And the return. The return is a 46. Could be something good for, uh, that is going to be good. 30 yards. Takes it out to the 31 yard line. <clears throat> Let's take 15 seconds off the clock there. Seven minutes left in the half. And it will be Kansas City ball. They're taking over seven minutes left at their own 31. And Mahomes and the Chiefs need a little magic here. So we're going to uh, just be passing the ball all over the place. 35 is going to be incomplete. That brings up second down and 10 for Mahomes. Another drop back pass. This time it's going to be the shotgun as he steps back, floats back a little bit, finds some room finds a pass and that's going to be to rice for 17 yards <clears throat> that'll go for a first down and let's say 10 plus 7 is out to the 48 they need the minnesota 42 for a first down but it'll be first and 10 kansas city from their own 48 a 55 is going to be an incompletion and that's going to bring up second down and 10 undeterred have Mahomes. 
with the wide receiver screen. This time it goes to Tony. Tony is going to get five on the screen. So that's going to be one, two, three, four, five. And that'll bring up third down and five for Kansas City in four down territory here. So another pass play. 35 is going to be incomplete and they're going to need that fourth down as another 15 ticks off the clock. And we are at five minutes and 15 seconds. Fourth down, this is the game. We got a pass play from Mahomes of 56 is going to be a defensive penalty. Oh my gosh, what is going on with Minnesota? A 22 is going to be a huge one. That is a pass interference down the field. 20 yards. Oh my gosh. 10, 20. Oh, so it's going to be first and 10 at the spot of the foul, which is a 27. And no, uh, well, we'll take off. 30 seconds there because I know that that's a play uh, where time runs off pass interference come on now Minnesota <clears throat> make a play first and 10 from the Minnesota 27 to 34 this is going to be a pass that is incomplete Mahomes undeterred drops back again he's in the shotgun 17 yards this is going to go to Moore for a gain of 17 that takes it down to the 10 it'll be first and goal from the 10 yard line four minutes left in the game Pat Mahomes trying to lead the team back and he's gonna get an offensive penalty here <clears throat> a 25 on an offensive penalty that's a pass that's minus five yards so that goes out to the 15 and uh, be first down and 15 after that false start <clears throat> Minnesota fans getting loud down in the uh, end zone there hard to hear and let's see he's barking out the orders Pat Mahomes uh, drops back and he fires and that's gonna be incomplete and the crowd only swells and gets louder the decibel levels going up in Minnesota second down and fifth or second down and goal from the 15 Pat Mahomes with another drop back this time he's gonna throw it out to the uh, halfback it's uh, Edwards Hilaire with the catch and he's gonna go for 12 yards and that'll be uh, first actually third down and goal from the three again four down territory here so Pat Mahomes with another pass 26 is gonna be for 15 yards now let's see that's gonna be uh, too much that's actually out of the end zone we only have 13 to work with, and that's a 15, and that's going to be a throwaway out of the back of the end zone in Kansas City. Down to a fourth down play here. Got three minutes left in the game. They really need this one. They're down by two scores, and it's going to be another pass from Pat Mahomes, a 34, and that's going to be incomplete, and the Vikings hold at the three, and that's going to be a turnover on downs. And that will be uh, two minutes and 45 seconds left in the game. So four, 415 on the drive, they come up short. It's 34 to 20. And Minnesota is gonna start hammering the ball here. So let's see if they can push it up the field on the ground as they take over at their own three. So. Switch those around. It'll be first and ten, Minnesota at the three yard line. I'll tell you, this one would be a killer. <laughs> they tried to run the sweep. All right. Running play for Minnesota. A 22. <laughs> oh, you can't make this stuff up, man. You can't make this stuff up. It's a fumble. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, gosh, out to the eight. Oh my goodness gracious. They do take 30 seconds off. I guess that part is good. Oh my goodness gracious. A fumble. It's two minutes and 15 seconds left in the game. Kansas City's going to take over. Sorry, i got to process this a little bit. He's going to take over with 2.15 left at the 8. 
Minnesota eight, not their own eight, which would be great. I'm dying here. All right, first and goal from the eight yard line. All right, Minnesota. Don't lose this game. First and goal. You know Kansas City's passing. 36 is going to be an incompletion. Takes us down to the two minute warning. <clears throat> Mahomes. 55, he drops back. He's incomplete again. Is that what gets knocked away? Third down and eight. Third and goal from the eight. Pat Mahomes again. Are they going to skunk him? That's going to be a defensive penalty on the pass. A 45 on a defensive penalty on a pass is going to be five yards. That takes it down to the three. Uh, still third down. No time off the clock. As Minnesota on the encroachment call. Kansas City's going to get crazy with it. They're going to try to run the ball in. A 12. That's going to be a slant off tackle for three, and that's going to be a touchdown. Caramba. That only takes 15 seconds off the clock. Uh, TD run. Three yards. And uh, 130. It takes just 45 seconds for them to score, although it took 45 seconds to score from the eight. Uh, the extra point is good. It's 27-34, and this is a wild one here. All right, <clears throat> we need a uh, we need an onside kick, and onside kicks happen at about a 13% clip or so in the NFL, which is uh. It's going to be good if it's one of these, um, one of these last, actually, no, let's see, let's figure out 13%. So 11, 12, or 13 is going to be, uh, good. So on the kickoff, it's, if it's an 11, 12, or 13, no, yeah, that should equal roughly 13%. It's actually, it might be a little bit more. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right, so Kansas City kicking off from the 35. One and a half minutes left in the game. It just feels like it's getting away. 11, 12, 13 is going to be a, an onside recovery for Kansas City. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh, and it's a 14. Minnesota recovers. They'll take over first and 10 at the Kansas City 45. Now, Kansas City has uh, three timeouts left. <sighs> so a timeout means that the clock is not going to move so this is going to be uh, first and 10 with one minute and 30 seconds left and they are at the Kansas City 45 all right so these are obviously going to be running plays uh, they're going to take three timeouts and so Minnesota's got to get a, a first down here to keep this one alive. <clears throat> 34 on a running play is going to be off tackle for four yards. Uh, so that goes down to the 41. Uh, timeout on the play. So no time off the clock. Minnesota second down and six. A 25. That's going to be pushing it a little bit forward. So out to the 39 brings up. Third down and four, another timeout on the play. So KC, only one timeout left. Going to run the ball here. And 11 is going to be an offensive penalty. Good Lord. Uh, 24 on a run is minus five yards. And so everything they had, they gave back. And they are going to have to run the ball again. Third down. <coughs> 22 is another fumble. I don't know what's happening here. All right, uh, so Minnesota fumbles the ball. This time it is Madison coughing up the ball. 
Uh, no need for a timeout. A change of possession. They're going to get a timeout. So they still have one left. So. Uh, one minute and 30 seconds. Uh, they take no time off the clock because of the timeouts. And, you know, maybe there will be a better timeout strategy. But this is going to make for quite an exciting finish. 27 34 is our score. Kansas City trying to climb back into this one. They have one minute and 30 seconds left, and they're going to take over at the uh, line of scrimmage plus five. So they return that to the 49, and so they'll take over at their own 49 yard line, first and 10. One and a half minutes left. They need a touchdown. Ah, uh, uh, they need a touchdown, all right? So uh, Kansas City's coming up firing. They have one, two, three, four, five, six plays. They have six plays to get it in the end zone. First pass from Mahomes is intercepted. Yes, Indy face. Oh my goodness, just as quickly as it starts, just as quickly as the city falls apart, the city is revived, resurrected even. So it's going to be uh, the 49 plus 15 yards, so that's going to be 10, and then 15 is out to the 36, so Minnesota will take over at their own 36, and Kansas City has one timeout. All right, so that's going to be uh, 15 seconds off the clock. Oh, man, this game is too much. It's making me old quick. And it'll be 115. If I can start at their own 36. What a turn of events. Those 22s are crazy. Stop that. All right, <clears throat> 22 only happens. Uh, that's about 2%. 2% of the time, two and a half. All right. So, first and 10, Minnesota. Let's think about this. They're going to run the ball. Kansas City's going to take a timeout. We're praying for anything except a fumble. <laughs> Almost fumbled it again. The 23 is going to be off tackle for one yard. Uh, so, out to the 37, it'll be second down and nine. Uh, KC takes their final timeout. <clears throat> they cannot stop the clock anymore. Minnesota needs to get a first down. Uh, 25 is going to be a dive straight ahead for two yards. Not particularly creative, but effective. There is one minute left in the game. And uh, they have third down and... Seven to go. Going to run the ball again. Hoping for a big run here. 24. That's not going to be enough as they get a counter play for two yards. And that's going to leave a little life open for the Chiefs. So we're going to get a punt. This will be from the Minnesota 41. On the punt, there are a couple of bad things. There can be a bad snap here. That would be a loss of 20 yards, and Kansas City would be taken over right here. There's a block, a minus 15, and Kansas City would be taken over right here. So we want to avoid the 11 and the 66 at all possible, if at all possible. Please just avoid the 11 and 66. A 26, that's a good one. All right, so we got a 50-yard punt. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, down to the 9. And there is one opportunity for a punt return for a touchdown, but you got to hit this and then roll a 10. So <laughs> we're going to leave that 10 roll. All right. Uh, that would be a, another 22. Right. Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. So punt return. So kick a 50. And the return is a 34, which is pretty good. Uh, but not what they need. Oh, good for Minnesota. Fair catch. <laughs> so, 
you know what? They're not going to fair catch it. That's not going to happen at the nine. So 24 is going to be a nine yard return. So, you know, if I was returning that kick, there's no way that I would uh, do a fair catch there. So uh, 30 seconds left in the game. <clears throat> And this is really just the longest. The longest forever and forever. And there are no uh, huge plays. We're going to have a Hail Mary. So we're going to get uh, one play and then a Hail Mary. And Hail Marys uh, happen. What is it? Uh, maybe maybe there would just be one on the 66. Um We'll have a passing play. So let's get a, a pass play here. Pat Mahomes, we didn't mark up our six. They're starting at the 15. <clears throat> KC, 30 seconds left in the game. They started their own 15. We're going to get a pass play here. A 15 is going to be a halfback screen. I don't know what they're thinking, but they're trying. And a uh, halfback screen is going to go for eight. And that goes out to the 23. Brings up second down. And this will be the final play of the game. If they roll a 66, it's a touchdown. And they tie the game. Otherwise, game is over. I don't even know if Pat Mahomes can throw it this far. But he doesn't. And whatever they were trying fails. That's the end of the game. And that will be it. As Minnesota, in a wild finish, Hangs on to, at the end. 27, uh, 34 27 is the final. And they, uh, they managed to score in the fourth. And so 14, 34. To 27, they scored 7. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. 34-27. So still a 7-point game. Minnesota comes out on top this time, which uh, was really hoping that would be the case. Three interceptions for Kirk Cousins. One interception for Pat Mahomes. You can see here, I might have to zoom in a little bit, but uh, <clears throat> our final. So, 34-27. You get an interception here by Kurt. Interception here, interception here, all killers. Uh, but Kansas City with the fumble here. Minnesota, another fumble. So turnovers all over the place. There's another fumble and interception uh at least they got a few back in this one but boy the uh they were able to overcome the uh the turnovers in this one couldn't do that in the real game as they got swallowed under but uh this is uh has no name it's just a dice football game again it's just based off of uh playing on base baseball and creating on base baseball and uh what would that look like if you ported it over to a football game it would look something like this and uh, you can see on here we've got all of our different plays here we got slants and off tackles and dives and a reverse and we got play action we got shotgun we got an empty set um we got all of our defensive penalties so whether it's a pass or a run uh, we have punting and punt returns field goals and extra points uh, kickoffs and kick returns i think we hit everything in this game and didn't feel like something was missing uh, I had to make up the uh, Hail Mary a little bit and had to make up the onside kick, but I, I have figured those out before, so it's just a matter of bringing those into the game. Excuse me, and maybe I need to put some numbers <clears throat> in the middle and on, on each side here. That would be probably helpful. We had a pump block, uh, which was pretty cool, and I had some several sacks in the game and uh, felt like enough penalties you know, normal game, seven to ten penalties total, and um, 
I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> Is this a winner? Is this, uh, it feels like a really fun game, actually. I don't know why people don't do, like, typical dice football games. Uh, but, um, feels like a winner to me. And uh, let me know what you think down in the comments section below. This has been a super long video. It's a football game. And it's play-by-play, -play, so, you know, I'm not cutting out any plays or anything. And that last, <clears throat> that last three minutes of the game were just psychotic. But, um, yeah, here we go. Uh, pretty cool stuff. I'll play more of this uh, on the tabletop. If you have any suggestions or comments for the game, leave them down in the comments section below. And I will make sure that I get to you as quickly as I can. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, click on subscribe. And uh, if you want to support me, just give a thumbs up anytime you see my videos. If you click subscribe, you'll get notified of new videos when they come out, usually one or two a week. And uh, you can purchase any of uh, the published games that I have at ClarkAndAddisonGaming.com. ClarkAndAddisonGaming.com. And uh, I've got baseball, football, basketball, <clears throat> still golf in the works. Going to be working on that over the winter. Probably give me something to, <laughs> something to look forward to spring with. And uh, I'll be continuing my work on precision, uh, precision baseball as well over the winter time. Uh, sometimes getting back into the baseball games and the uh, summer sports helps me to make it through a Chicago winter. So it uh, kind of gets rough around here. Uh, this can be very cool. I'll probably put on another season of up-tempo basketball, maybe another classic season. So if you have any suggestions there, uh, you can let me know at Clark and Addison gaming at gmail.com. And uh, as always, uh, if you want to support me, just purchase a game, uh, purchase a season, or uh, at the very least, you can just click that thumbs up button. And that helps a lot. Share uh, the game, share this channel, um, share what you saw with your friends and, uh, if you drum up excitement, it matters a lot more than if I try to drum up excitement. So, um, yeah, seems good. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. So, um, let's see where this goes. And uh, we'll see what happens with this little game. You're doing good, game. We'll, we'll keep you around. We'll keep working.